welcome to today's vlog. I am currently on my way to acupuncture. I have a few things on my list for today, like deep cleaning my apartment. I just got cleared yesterday to finally get back to regular life. I can carry groceries, I can clean my house, I can exercise, I can do all the regular things now. So that makes me really happy. So today I'm dedicating to tidying up my space. I was telling you guys on my Instagram story that this week and next week is going to be mostly like a catch up week for me. Just kind of resetting my space, resetting everything because um you know everything's been back to back ever since the beginning of the year and i haven't had the chance to actually pick off the year the way that i wanted to so now that i can do things i'm gonna do that uh like this week so today i'm doing some deep cleaning i have to go put gas <laughs> i have to wash my car i think i want to do a target run maybe we'll see and what else do I have to do? I have to make a list on my notes for my phone because if not, I'll be running around not knowing what I'm doing. So I'm gonna write some stuff right now when I park. I also have fresh hair today and next week. I'm making, I just remembered I need to make an appointment with my hair colorist that I have not seen or I've seen her because my cousin went to her do her hair with her and um, but I haven't gone to her to do my hair in a while because I was living, you know, further away. So I want to go for a deep conditioning on my hair. Um, maybe, depending on what she sees, maybe like a trim and a color refresh. Maybe. Let me actually I'll make a U turn. I just got out of acupuncture and I feel so relaxed and so zen. But um, now I wanna make a list of what I need to do today. I know I need to clean up the house. I Do I wanna do my eyebrows or not? Maybe not, maybe I'll just touch them up at home and just wait. Before I even do anything because I'm about to kind of get started on picking up a little. I'm gonna make myself some breakfast too. I'm gonna put my hair up in a ponytail though. It's kind of I just washed it, but I don't want to have my hair down while I'm cleaning. I have so much hair. Okay, I'm gonna need some good problems to have, but so This jacket that I'm wearing, by the way, I got from Old Navy. It was on sale. It was super inexpensive. It has a hoodie on it, and it zips up right here. It has pockets at the bottom. It's cozy. It's like a neutral brown shade, and it's comfy. It's perfect because lately the weather has really been on and off. Like some days it's nice and warm, and then this week it was raining. But then next weekend, it's supposed to be like 80 degrees. So it's like, what? All right, I think we're good. So um, I got a package right now in the mail. I'm about to show you because I'm excited about it. I'm switching out my bedding. Let me show you what we're doing. This part of today's vlog is sponsored by the one and only Brooke Linen. I have seen Brooke Linen everywhere and i'm so excited to finally have my hands on one of their sets and to be trying them out for myself y'all know i love home stuff and making my home feel cozy and because i've seen this everywhere i've been very intrigued to try it brooklinen is known to give you high quality bedding at a good price point because they pretty much cut out the middleman you still get the very luxurious and stunning feeling and look to your more simple bedding except for the fact that you're not paying for the luxurious price point. I'm gonna open this up so we can see the inside. Making my space feel like home has been so, so, so huge to me lately. 
So, you know, just adding little things like this, really nice bedding or like really nice home decor, anything like that, to me at least, it makes it feel more cozy. And then in turn, just makes it feel more homey, more like me. It's just one of those forms of self-care for me. So let me show you what's on the inside here. The one that I chose is their Lux Hardcore Sheet Bundle. Buying the bundle just seems a lot easier. If you do buy a bundle, you save up to 25% and you get everything you need. You get the core sheet set, extra pillowcases, and a whole duvet cover. So here is the core Lux core sheet set and just like I said you get the flat sheet you get a fitted sheet two pillowcases here are the extra pillowcases right here just in case like right now I'm going to throw this stuff in the washer but just in case you're in between mixing things or if you're like me and you have four pillows instead of two then you have extra pillowcases so that actually comes through big time and then you have the soft smooth ultra luxe duvet cover that I'm gonna replace my current one with so literally comes with every single thing that you need for bedding and on top of that they sent this cute tote as well that says Brooklinen on it and a pamphlet you know when you go to a hotel and the sheets feel very soft and they have kind of like a sheen to them that's exactly how these look and feel they have a 480 thread count and like i said they have more of that slightly luminous look to them which makes them more silky and more luxurious feeling just like a hotel and you don't have to get white they do offer 20 plus colors on there so you can really pick anything that goes with your style or your preferences i just did white because that's what i always go for but they do have a lot of different options in this set specifically too if you um you know want a different color enough to give me a discount code for all of my viewers and my followers on here in case you guys are interested in buying the luxe set that i got or any other bundle or products on their website they also have a lot of other things on there too just in case you want to check them out you can use my code marie j at checkout it gives you 20 dollars off of a hundred dollar purchase and i will also have a link down below for you guys to check out and once again big thank you to brooke lennon for sponsoring today's vlog Honestly, most of this vlog I think is going to just be music because I'm gonna get to finally tidying up in here. 
and then later once i finish this i think i'm gonna go get a car wash because i wanted to wait until it gets a little bit warmer outside because it's still kind of chilly so for now i'm gonna tidy up and let me just show you my apartment it's not too bad but there's there's stuff okay so gotta clean this up dishes that i need to toss i need to put this laundry stuff away i need to throw all of this in the dishwasher after i rinse it and then for my living room i have to pick it up to just a whole tidy up because things are just everywhere i need to take the trash out just you know also gonna get that hung up i think right here remember i had this at my old apartment i think i want to hang it up here or by the doorway but i just have it sitting there for right now and i'm doing a deep clean i'm talking deep cleaning the bathroom my bedroom everything is all picked up now i wanted to show you guys the new curtains that i ended up getting for the living room just to close out the vlog i'll show you right now but i purchased these clips right here to go ahead and use for the curtains because the curtains that i have it's kind of hard to show because i'm pointing you at the curtains and the lights coming in but i'm not a fan of the ruffles at the top right there it just kind of gives me more of like a younger girly feel um which is you know it's fine but i'm not really that's not really the look i'm going for so i bought these right here in hopes that it'll kind of switch up the look just a little bit and i'm gonna put these up um probably later today 
but here's a close-up of the actual curtains and i love the linen look that they have to them and also the fact that they're sheer because when i film in here i want to uh, try to film like a few sit down videos and I want to test the lighting because usually with super bright lighting it's a little bit harsh but if you put curtains like this it just gives the perfect lighting because it kind of diffuses the light a little bit and makes it more soft but still nice so I got these here for the living room and I just think they're like the perfect look and then for this side I still haven't had them put the curtains because I'm waiting for the curtain rods to come in because they're out of stock but I did order some more curtains for this side and I got the lengths 108 by 52 and I added some in the bedroom too let me show you and this is how they look in the bedroom again i can't really show you a whole lot because it's going to show the outside of my apartment but they're so 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 pretty and they go perfectly with the tones because surprisingly i don't have a whole lot of white in the apartment i have a lot of creams but not bright white so adding the curtains just give it gives it more of a bright crispy white look and it adds a little something aside from you know just the cream colors that are in here and it ties in with the base what is this like baseboard or whatever you know what i'm talking about and the very last thing i'm about to show y'all is that i semi organized underneath my kitchen sink i filmed a reel or a tiktok one of the two of what i did here but i'll link some of this stuff for you guys in case you want to do it because i didn't record it on my camera which i just completely forgot to because I was too focused on getting it on my phone. But eventually I want to change out all of these bottles or most of them into some other ones that are more similar, like all the same type of bottles and just label them with whatever these are. And then down here too, I want to find like different bottles. And this comes out super cute. So i now have a lot more space before i just had a basket under here and it was just not working because everything was stuffed in there and i would end up piling stuff on top i couldn't find certain things and this it's a little bit more organized not as organized as i want it to be yet but it makes a little bit more sense than how it was before you know what i mean and then i have my dishwasher pods these are the makeup drawers that i showed you guys like ooh, like a year or two ago i two years ago when I was living, not at my old apartment, but the apartment before that one, I stored all of my makeup in these small drawers. So I'll link them for you guys here. I just have sponges, magic erasers. I have my dishwasher pods. These I don't really use, but I didn't want to get rid of them and I didn't have a spot for them. So I just put them in there. Trash bags down here. And then obviously a bag full of bags because that's just how we do in like Mexican and black households. <laughs> in many households in general honestly i'm sure a lot of you guys do this put grocery bags inside of grocery bags and you just have them there you know Porque uno nunca sabe. <laughs> um, these i don't know what i want to put those in but i just kind of have them there and then i have my other simple human trash bags right there so that's kind of what it looks like it looked crazy before it's not exactly how i want it to be yet but you know it looks a little bit better that is it for this vlog i'm actually closing this video out like a few days later but that's it i'm gonna link the stuff from underneath the sink for you guys in case you guys want to you know shop and organize underneath your sink the curtains the brooklyn and stuff all of that again thank you to brooklyn for sponsoring a part of today's vlog check the description box for all of the info and that's it Thank you guys for tuning in. I love you guys and I'll see you all in my next video.